Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Everyday EDC. My name is Tyler and today it's not really a knife video but it's knife related. Those of us who don't want to spend $24 on a Weeha bit driver or something of that nature, I got a haul for you guys to kind of show you guys some cheap stuff that you can do on your own plus a couple of sorted things that I didn't get from this particular place that you may be pretty interested in uh, saving some cash here, alright? So, first and foremost, let's go through this goodie bag that we got. This. Job, job Smart Speed Fit Screwdriver Set. It's a cheap-ass screwdriver set, but it, it, it has everything. So, we got the T2, T3, T4, T5, T6, T7, T8. So, it goes all the way up to T8. And... I think we have some other styles that may fit the T10s and whatnot. They just have the punch out in the center. This was like four bucks, okay? You get your freaking Weeha bit driver, that's 24 bucks. This, this is in the clearance section of Menards. This is another driver that has all your screwdriver bits. And even this thing's actually pretty damn comfortable. All these different tools in here, some of which may work for other things that we need. But let's see, what does this have? T7, T8, T9, T10, T15, T20. So it's got all your Torx heads that you need. This was $5 in the clearance section. Again, are these going to be high quality? Are they going to strip? Potentially. But they're not going to strip. It's going to fit the need as opposed to spending a bunch of money when you could spend some more money on other screws and, I'm sorry, other knives. Just a bit set. This was $2 from Menards. You can replace your, your stripped out bits from this all right that that's 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 not mine um i don't know how that got in there uh cut okay welcome back that was awkward all right so we got some 400 grit sandpaper. This is getting to be pretty fine when it comes to sandpaper. This will work for cleaning some of your blades. Um, you can even use this, I, honestly, for sharpening. I don't recommend it, but you can. I mean, there's a lot of functions that you can use this for. I have some in mind. I'm not going to tell you what it is because I think I'm going to do a video on it. These things for a Dremel toolkit. These are polishing wheels. Again, you can get these for dirt cheap there. Some more sandpaper. This is 800 grit. Extra fine, right? Some acetone. I got the acetone to clean off the blades whenever I do an acid wash or I do something where I have to paint my blade or any piece of metal in order to protect it with some enamel paint, right? That's for knife mods. Instead of using my wife's nail polish, it's just some enamel paint. This was a dollar for this little thing. And you're not going to go through that because you're only painting little spots. This stuff is... <laughs> this is not for that. This is for protecting your cords outside. Last but not least, another set of Torx. I got two of these. Like, we're set up. I don't need to worry about stripped out. If they strip, I'll just replace them. These are $2 a packet. And then last but not least, guys, here's three items. This came from Wish. This is a Torx driver set. Now look at how cool this looks. Now I know this is aluminum, but you see these going for like titanium for like, what was it? I don't know, 60 bucks? You don't need to do that to get one that looks cool. This thing, I hated on Wish before, but they actually have some cool stuff like this. You're just going to wait a couple months. This whole set, I think I only had to pay shipping because that's how Wish works sometimes. It was like three bucks. Let's see what it's got in it. It's got some Torx heads, a T8, we got a T6, I'm only looking at the Torx because that's all we care about, T10, T15, what's this, not a Torx head, so you have everything here, right, super cheap set, it's not going to feel high quality, but it looks cool, and it also fits the need, three bucks, my homemade strap. I had some synthetic leather sitting around, so I cut it up, I put it on a block of wood, put some paste on there, good to go. That's all it is. This probably cost me, when it was all said and done, 15 bucks for the paste that lasts a long time if you use it right. 
the synthetic strop, which I got again off a of wish when I was on that kick for like two bucks and a block of wood that I had sitting in my garage. This is the one you guys are really going to like. And you got to be careful and not treat it like I did. This is a diamond uh, sharpening plate with a 400 grit and a 1000 grit on the other side. Everything you need to sharpen, this has. 400 to 1000. That's really all you need for all your basic stuff. I sharpened a knife with it the other day by walking around my house and just going up and down and flip the side, go up and down, knocked off the burr as best as possible. I realized I made a freaking huge burr because I just forgot that I was using a diamond plate versus a whetstone. This whole setup here, which I did not take care of and I should have, once again, you can find this shit on Wish for like four bucks. Like, insane. The point being here, guys, is that you don't have to spend a lot of money to get the stuff you need to kind of make mods, to kind of do what you got to do. Now, this is the most expensive thing that I would recommend that you can do a lot of stuff with. Sorry. That you can do a lot of stuff with. A Dremel tool. Everybody needs one for assorted things anyways. So, just get one. I got this from Ace Hardware for 99 bucks. You can probably find them elsewhere for cheaper. It's great. I love it. I've used it for polishing my blades. I've made some tiny modifications to flipper tabs and stuff with it. You can use it for just simple cleaning. And that's not one of the cheap things that on the list. That's just sitting in my tool station. But that's just an idea of the kind of setup that you can have. Everything on my tool station is basically everything I need short of the ferric acid, which you can get for like 12 bucks on Amazon. And then the dye from Rit Dye More, you can get like synthetic dye for three bucks a dye. And if you use it right, you get the right pot, you know, because don't use a pot that's super big because you have to use more of it. Use a long, tall, narrow pot. You can get way more bang for your buck. Man, you guys can go a long way with your stuff. Quick, short video. Just wanted to show you guys. I talked about all these things. This thing I'm most impressed with. Once I said, like I said, five bucks. And look at this. This is actually pretty nice for five bucks. If this was on Blade HQ, we'd be paying 15 for it just because of what it is, right? And, and, and yeah, I, I get it. I'm not hating on them for that. That's just reality for the way the world works. People got to make money. But this is how you can save some money. Here's a knife. This is a knife channel. Boom. All right, guys. Have a great freaking Saturday. Love you guys. I Honestly, I'm genuinely appreciative of everybody that watches this channel. So is Ronnie. And I'm not... Ronnie, you're too much. But uh, love you guys. Stay sharp. Stay safe. If you guys haven't subscribed, like I just wrote to one of the new guys that was making a comment on a video, if you have not subscribed to my videos yet, remember, I am never announcing giveaways, and you guys already know, I kind of do quite a bit, right? So if you want if you want to get in on that, it, this is kind of your selling point. Subscribe. You'll, you'll start to see more as the notifications come up. All that being said, the guys that won the knives uh, in the past, I know I took a long time to get them out. I got every single knife out today, and I even drew some last-minute penguin pictures for Travis and Trevor because you guys requested it. It is labeled counterfeit Frankie picture because trademark LLC. Uh, but the, last, the one person I did not ship it out to was Joey. So, Joey, if you didn't see my message on Instagram... See it now. Send me your address because I have your stuff all packaged. That awesome DeWalt wrench. You don't want to miss out on that big guy. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Tyler. This has been Everyday EDC. Happy mother freaking Halloween.